A warm front scooting in from the southwest, and as predicted, that is slipping us into an active weather pattern. Hi, folks. Happy Wednesday to you. I'm First Alert Meteorologist Matt Chambers. Many of you have already dealt with some rain this morning. The good news is that's a short-term issue. It's going to be winding down in the metro by about 10 o'clock this morning. A couple of rumbles of thunder out there, too. We might have some showers hanging on to the north and east of St. Louis until about lunchtime, but even in our Illinois counties, I expect we'll be dry by midday. And then this afternoon, since it is a warm front, the leading edge of warmer air moving Moving in, how about a high near 80 degrees after only 71 under blue skies yesterday? So yeah, what a change from this morning. The clouds, the rain to upper 70s and partly cloudy with that rain long gone again by lunchtime. So 57 degrees at 9 a.m. with again maybe a spotty thunderstorm still hanging around. By lunchtime, rain's out. 69 degrees. Evening drive looks fine. 76 degrees and mostly sunny by that time. As I mentioned, this warm front just triggers kind of the onset of a period of active weather that lasts for about four days here. Take a look. You got scattered rain this morning and then it's out of here. 79 for the high. Tomorrow we're breezy and warm up to about 80 after a morning low of 61. And then Friday, this is sort of the last chapter of this storm system. A sharp cold front, a powerful one builds in from the west. About a 70% chance of some showers and some thunderstorms in the mix there as well. 74 for the high. Stay with us over the next couple of days as we hone in on the timing of that rain Friday. Right now, it really looks like anywhere from morning commute time to late afternoon and early evening, we could be dealing with some showers and thunderstorms. So again, stay tuned for updates there. Now into the weekend, there's a reason we call it a cold front. That's the leading edge of colder air. And what a whiplash here from 80 Thursday to 59 for the high on Saturday. Now think about this. That could be kind of a raw day. Some gusty winds, maybe a couple of stray showers, partly sunny to mostly cloudy skies. Similar day on Sunday, but the winds start to drop off a little bit, and it doesn't look like we'll have to deal with any sprinkles or showers on Sunday. It does look like the low 60s are back by early next week as we finally settle back into a quieter weather pattern. Have a great Wednesday out there and enjoy the warmer weather.